first thing in the morning, it's time to weigh myself. But it doesn't look like the numbers are very promising. Yikes! My clothes are getting a little tight. I should probably eat healthier for a while. But these salads are driving me crazy. I need more calories. What's this? Oh, my favorite! No, chocolate demon! I'm stronger than that! Get back in your box! No temptations, no problem! <laughs> From this day on, no more sugary food! I won't let a single piece of candy through! Come here! You can't trick the candy scanner! So you'll have to give your treasures to this hag! <laughs> now it's your turn, miss! Breaking the rules? <laughs> Whoa! So many snacks! What do you have there, honey? She has even more! How do they even fit all that? Oof. This teacher is no exception either. Now Miss Fluff's desk has enough candy for the next month. All this confiscated treasure is going into a deep drawer. We'll save it for when the diet is over. Grammar class is a great reason to taste some knowledge. Let's find out how to make a delicious textbook like this one. Take four wafer cakes. Add Nutella. Spread it out evenly and connect the pages. Roll out some fondant. Add the Nutella covered wafers and wrap them up. Adjust the cover and use a stencil to apply food coloring. Here. You're eating your textbook? <laughs> That's sacrilege! I just need to finish before class starts. Mmm, the paper tastes amazing! This clearly is an edible. The flavor will be our little secret. Who will answer this next question? Yes, yes, you! While the student does his best, Tony notices an unusual belt. We'll need a roll of gum, belt fasteners, and a stapler. Finally, gum! Tony couldn't help it and shared with his friends. But every action has an equal and opposite reaction. Poor guy lost <gasps> his pants and his place in the classroom. Jenny is getting hungry again. Uh-oh, the chalk broke! Do you have a spare? Jenny seems nervous. We need to get rid of the evidence! It seems like Miss Fluff figured out that this is candy. Sorry, Jenny! Drinking a marker? This must be another life hack from our hungry heroine. First, take apart a marker. And clean out any remaining ink. Then fill the marker with Fanta. Add a straw and close it. Mean teacher senses junk food again. This means trouble. <gasps> Fanta, all over your notebook? I'm writing you up. Jenny is still hungry.
hungry. Poor thing. What did she come up with this time? A sneaky hiding place for her chips. Take a small container of chips. And use a sponge to cover it with acrylic paint. Add a drawing of a pencil. And attach it to the lid. Now you can have a pencil case. Jenny's pencil case is attracting a lot of attention. This is for the Fanta. <gasps> Revenge is a dish best served cold. We have a new exchange student. He's an athlete. Miss Fluff explains the rules. It seems like his muscles are making a strong impression. But they are not just muscles, right? Yeah, nobody likes liars. What a letdown! While the teacher isn't looking, we can think about eating. Oh. But a snitch ruins the girl's plans. The teacher is out on the hunt. Miss Fluff confiscates the menu to study it thoroughly. That amazing smell is driving her crazy. She's deep in her thoughts, dreaming about a restaurant. The heavenly taste of a baked potato with some tender turkey. Lots of herbs and spices. Oh, this is awkward. There's no junk food allowed in this classroom. I think it's time for an inspection. What? The scanner is down? No big deal. Miss Fluff has a plan B. Nobody can escape this x-ray! <laughs> yes, Jenny! Nobody wants their food to be confiscated! But those are the rules of the school! And of Miss Fluff's strict diet! <laughs> Caroline has her own sweet secret! Isn't she adorable? The best part of her outfit is her cute headband. To make one just like this, start with a plain headband and parchment paper. Apply a good layer of edible glue and attach whatever treats you want. Our delicious accessory is ready. Oh, Caroline, you forgot that candy is sticky. Poor thing! Now she can eat her stress away! The hair doesn't really add much to the dish. If you want to hide something, hide it in plain sight. Or not quite plain! Today's class will be about food suddenly ending up on the floor! Miss Fluff got scared half to death! The best way to fight temptation against junk food is to give in! No one will notice if I just have a little piece, right? <sighs> I had a snack. Now I can go back to work. Hey, what's going on here? Go to the principal! Annie is planning something. It looks like there's a hidden chocolate bar in her locker. But how can she sneak it into the classroom? She can just say she was visiting her grandmother. Her trick worked. The teacher didn't notice anything. Chocolate, it's your time to shine. Mmm, that's delicious. 
have there, you little sneak? Oh, it's just a marker. I've got my eye on you, newbie. Ha, looks like someone mixed up their classes. Weirdo. How would you sneak junk food into school? Tell us in the comments. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and click on the bell so you never miss a new video.